understand this. Algorithms have to be programmed to go somewhere. In other words, if they're programmed to go somewhere, that's what creates the liquidity moves, you see. So one of the biggest trades, one of the most consistent losing trades is trying to short a breakdown. Okay. Why does that get emotional, uh, Andrew? Because the low for the day was 2575. Okay. My buy side zone, my support area was 25 to 28. Okay. So the algorithms want to go to a discount area. So the algorithms go to an area. They don't just, they don't just throw a dart at uh, Barron's financials and say, this is the area I want to go to. No, it has to be programmed. So where does it get? So who's leading who here, folks? Did the algorithms really control the market? Or the algorithms control the market only because there are technicals, historical technicals for them to go to, to create this liquidity. So false breakdown. So today, 25 and, uh, 25 and three quarters, uh, 25 spot 75 algorithm. The market's coming down, coming down, coming down, coming down. Yeah, premium and discount. That's correct. So they go down to a discount area, which happens to be, which happens to be the support area which happens to be a major support area. The algorithms know where that is. So what do they do? They come down and they try to emotionalize the investors. The market had come down, the market had come down. It was still sketchy, it was still sketchy. They, they thought it was all over. So whoever doesn't believe and tries to short that failed breakdown, they're done. That creates the liquidity. So what happens? So the longs sell out their longs, so they're not there to prevent the market from going up and and, 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 and having supply. The shorts, uh, the shorts are already short, so they have to cover their short when they realize they've been had. So you got a situation, and the reason why fall breakdowns don't work is because of that, those two reasons. So the longs puked out, the shorts got the shorts, the shorts are short, they have to cover and create buy side. And the longs don't have don't own it anymore. So what happens? The shorts cover and the longs reload. And there you go. And there's your liquidity.